Today I'm going to show you exactly how you can install Forge for Minecraft 1.19.4 and it's really simple and it's basically just like any other version of Forge. Anyways, we can head right in right now. So the first thing you actually want to do before we download it is open up the Minecraft launcher right here. Then you want to go over to the installations tab and here you can see um, some of the installations you have so the latest release which in this case is 1.19.4 anyways you um, want to look for other versions of forge yeah and this can be any version of forge here I've got forge 1.8.9 in my case you might have 1.19.3 or another version Basically what you just want to do is click on the three dots over here and then delete that, yeah? Because the sad thing is you cannot have more than one version of Forge at once, yeah? Once you look at the installations and you see no other versions of Forge here, then you're good. So if this is your first time installing Forge, then you're fine as well. The next thing that you can do is head over to the top link in the description, which is going to bring you to this page of Forge and the Minecraft 1.19.4 version. There's only one version here, which is the latest version, and this is the one you want to download. So you can click on the installer button right over here, and then you're going to get this prompt over here to make a Forge server and stuff like that. Yeah, um, you'll need to look at it for five seconds and then you can click on the red skip button over there. And then as you can see in the bottom left, Forge is downloading. So now, as you can see, we can take a look in our downloads and we've got Forge right here. Now. If you've had a version of Forge or something like that before, then you can skip ahead 10 seconds. But if you haven't, then this is very important. Basically, to make Forge run, you need to download Java. And this is not Minecraft Java, but this is Java. Yeah, um, here's the download right here. I'm not going to download it because I have it already. Um, and you basically need Java to make it run. If you're unsure whether you have Java or not, you can always just download it and try installing it. And then it might just tell you that Java's already installed. Anyways, as I said earlier, if you've ever run successfully a version of Forge before, then you won't need to worry about this because you already have it. Anyways, continuing, um, once you have made sure that you have Java, um, then you can take a look at this Forge 1.19.4 right over here, which in my case is in my downloads because I downloaded it. And then you can just double click on that. Yeah, um, so if you just want to use Forge for mods, which is what this tutorial is for, um, you want to make sure it's on install client and then this is the location where it's going to get installed and that's exactly where you want to keep it. You want to keep it there in your .minecraft folder and then you can just click on OK. It's going to download the libraries, it's going to download everything it needs um, to, you know, be able to run on your device and for it to be able to work and run mods for you. And now after waiting for hopefully a not a very long as you can see, successfully installed client profile for version 1.19 Forge into Launcher, and they've downloaded eight libraries as well, which you, which are just basically things you need to run your mods. Yeah. Once you've done that, you can click on OK right over here. You'll see that you've got a new um, file as well. This is basically the download log of everything that happened to be able to download it. Yeah not very interesting um, you can delete that if you want and basically now you have forge installed so if you click on the minecraft launcher and then wait for it to load um, you should be able to see um, a version of forge right over here 
this installation, Forge 1.19.4. That is the exact one you want. Yeah, then you can basically just click on play. Um, it's going to give you a very short pop-up because of the fact that, you know, Forge is modded and it, it can be unstable, basically, things like that. But you're fine to play Forge now. Anyways, guys, thank you ever so much for watching. Um, I really hope you enjoyed the video. If you have any questions, make sure to leave those down in the comments below. But for right now, thank you ever so much for watching, and I hope to see you again in the next one. Bye-bye.